right, everybody. So today we're going to test my new tension release that I made uh, super cheap for my drone to turn my DJI Phantom 3 into a fishing drone. All right, as you've seen in our previous videos, I use a Phantom 3 for fishing and I made this frame out of chopsticks for my drone. And the way I used my drone previously was I used to hang my bait or my sinker over this forward facing hook, fly the drone out forward and when I want to, wanted to release my bait I just turned the drone around and the bait would slide off. Now this works pretty good but I wanted to try a tension release. Now when you look at those commercially sold fishing drones they always have tension release and it's basically uh, two little metal stainless steel, bo steel balls that are pressed together by springs and then you clip your bait into there and then when there's enough tension uh, on the drone it will just release so you fly your drone out and then you close your bail arm essentially and the bait will uh, release so i thought well this is pretty simple so what i came up with is this here so i stole a close pack and i used some kevlar cord you know this is the cord that you use for assist hooks on lures and I just made uh, one loop here and I attached that to a swivel. Now the swivel might not be 100% necessary, but I think if there are some twists in your line, uh, it will just help so that this doesn't, you know, uh, twist so much. And then I made a second loop through that cloth pack and that's pretty much all it is. Oh, and I used a fairly fancy cloth pack. See, this has some kind of rubber grip inside. So that will hold the line better. And to adjust the tension, I just wrap a rubber band around here, like so. And now I got a whole lot more tension on here as well. So I can just adjust it to whatever I, I think is suitable. With my previous uh, bait release, with this uh, frame that I made here, it's really easy to attach. I just put that over here and uh, go through with this, just make a loop so that it can't slide left or right and it can't slide off as well. So as simple as this, this is my idea for a tension release. The length of this Kevlar rope, I thought it's probably best not to have it too long so that it could potentially get into the props. And with a clothes pack hanging down like this, I can uh, just put the drone down, land the drone like this, no problem at all. So now the rig I'm using for drone fishing is just a simple two hook rig. Two dropper hooks and one breakout sinker. Breakout sinker I'm using here is five ounce. I think my close pack will be strong enough to hold this. Now guys, to attach this uh, to the drone, to the clothing pack, I made out of a 120 pound uh, mono leader, this kind of thing here, like one loop, a short piece of leader, one loop on one end and another loop on the other end. And I just clamped that down with some trims. All right, one loop goes to the sinker and this will hold it up and this one, just clips onto the clothes pack and uh, depending on the thickness of the leader or line you're using here the stronger it will hold obviously so 120 pounds seems to work good for me but yeah I could even probably go up to a 200 pound with a thicker line and have more tension all right as you can see here I just clipped that onto my pack like so now I'm just gonna try pulling it out and see how much tension uh, we're putting on here so it clips off pretty easy. The drone will be able to pull that free on its own. I'm just gonna open that bail arm here. So just gonna fly out this drone at 80 meters down this way. And then we just close the bail arm and we wanna drop the line. Yep, so that worked uh, pretty easy. I use a banana prawn for bait. So I just salted them recently. I actually salted them together with a few pilchards and they turned out really nice. If I was a fish, I would probably want to eat that and they hold together quite nice as well. Uh, if we use shrimps for bait, the good thing is uh, we won't catch any sharks. All right, two nice tasty baits here. All right guys, now comes the real test.
So that worked pretty good. Uh, I'm quite happy with it. And good. It's very big wave. So guys, you see how simple that is to use a drone for fishing? All you need is a cloth pack and some chopsticks. I don't know if I got a bite here. Also, the sinker just uh, rolling around. Guys, if you want to see how we uh, used to catch fish with, with the previous release that we've been using, just the forward-facing hook, I made a video on that, so better check it out up here. Uh, and you see how easy that is as well. Very good size power, yeah? Nice fish.